Hello everyone and welcome back to XCOM. We have a couple of new soldiers. We have Chris, YouTube user that Swift Gamer. Um, this person came from the reward that we got in the last mission. We got a heavy. So here you go, Chris. You are now on the team. You have uh, bullets, ah, <laughs> bullet swarm, uh, shredder rocket, and heat ammo. We also have Warden557, a uh, YouTube user uh, Laura Lugo. So welcome to the team, Laura. I will try to get you a mech as soon as possible. And that is it. I still have one more uh, female slot open because I haven't heard back from uh, Jack yet to see if she wanted to switch to this person because, you know, if you don't want to be a sniper. So, with that being said, let us scan for activity. Incoming transmission. I think we lose Hello, Japan. Man. Yeah, Watch and Australia. Yeah. A number of council members have recently withdrawn their support. That is unfortunate. Excellent work, Commander. This Let me see. We just got some more money. Continued support of this project has been worthwhile. Um. We hope that your current successes only mark the beginning. We manufacture of one of these Reaper rounds to eliminate the extraterrestrial threat. And oops. Let me hire you some additional touch, soldiers. Commander. Okay, scan for activity. Okay. Panic in Russia. Oh man, exalt agitation. What? Man, you punks. All right, uh, I guess we got another covert operation then. Let's send out... Hmm. I probably want to use Talmac, Abe. Um, let's send out David, because I plan on using Pwninator this time for our sniper. So, David. There you go, buddy. Good luck on your mission. Covert operative deployed to disrupt exalt cell in Russia. Okay. All right, ab Command. abduction sites. We're tracking several reported abductions via the Hologlobe. I've got the coordinates locked in. It's too bad none of these are in Russia. So we either try for the new sniper, engineers, or scientists. Engineers or scientists? Um, let's go with engineers. All right. Uh, we will clear you out of here, Skyrim. Add Poninator. And let's clear out Abe and add Warden. All right, we also got those three new soldiers, so I'll assign more people to the team here in a bit. Okay, so make items available, except let's load you up. Armor, let's get you an exalt sniper rifle, why not? A pistol. A scope. Oh, I don't know. A nano fiber vest for additional HP. Uh, you're fine. You're fine. Carapace, laser rifle, respirator, and a scope. And then Chris. Carapace, exalt, exalt. All right, I wanted to try the Reaper rounds on um, Tall Mac, I think. As 20% critical chance against organic targets, doubles the weapon's range penalty. Yeah. Hmm. All right, let me go back to Tall Mac. Oops. Also, I would like to get you a pistol, a laser pistol. Hmm. But I also want you to have the Arc Thrower and as much HP as possible. Well, crap. Maybe we won't have the Reaper Rounds on you. Hmm. Double the range penalty. Can we put it on a sniper? Uh. Secret chance against organic targets. Doubles the weapon range penalty. Guess we can try it with uh, with you. We're also going to need to go back to briefing 
because I need to make another item here. I want to make another pistol. And... Another one of these. Man, we're down to $10 already. Uh, nope. China. There we go. And then I want to give Talmac a laser pistol. Okay. Let's, uh, let's, let's try this out. So Chris does have Bullet Swarm, so he has the potential to shoot twice, so maybe that penalty isn't going to be so bad. But I don't know, doubles the range penalty. That's... Strike one. That is pretty harsh. Alright, begin assault. We're heading into China for the next operation. Okay. We've gotten several reports indicating that the aliens have stepped up the number of attempted abductions. We'll have to move quick. Hmm, okay. Trying to abduct more people. Oh, wow. Oh, this is new. I love all the new maps. I'm glad to see so many. Central, Big Sky in position on approach of the abduction site. Strike one is awaiting drop clearance. Copy that, Big Sky. Strike one is cleared to all right. hostile targets. Where Watch your backs out there, people. is the meld? Give me the meld. Hmm. Don't see any in sight, so let's move up this way, I guess. We'll start with, um, yeah, let's start with Warden here. Okay. Alien object in sight. Oh, wow, okay. Three turns. Three turns. Uh, move up Poninator here. We'll move up Laura here to try and see down there, see if there's any aliens. Or, Laura. <laughs> All right, llama. All right, you don't see anything. Let's dash up, Chris. Dash up, Talmac. And yes, Commander. Move up, Ronak. An Overwatch. Actually, I think we'll dash up Kellyan. Ooh, that may be dangerous. Well, they don't see anything, so it should be safe to dash up to at least here. Oh, right, Llama. I also gave you the uh, jet boot module, so you can jump up high if you need to. Poninator. I don't know, I'm kind of tempted to just move you up. Eh. Oh god, that was a muton. Oh boy, uh, let's move up Llama. Yep. Are they in flaming range? Ah, oh, only one is. Well, that's six damage we know we can do to that guy. Chris also has a shredder rocket. All right, let's uh, open this one up with a bang. Oh, whoa, 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 cancel, what? Oops, oops, almost messed up there. Wait, why is that? Oh, the meld. Oh, you dirty pieces of crap. I did not even realize we could blow that up. I could not capture Muton because I cannot stun when I run a gun. Uh, but we can run a gun Tomac here, so that would definitely finish off this guy. Hmm. Is there any way I can get an angle without hitting the meld? Aha! Got it. Alright, cool. Alright, Chris. Nice job, sir. Nice job. Okay. Still have a lot of hit points, but it should be easier to kill them. 
I think I want to keep you for the flame throw. Well, well, now that I know that Tomac can definitely kill that one, what's your chance of hitting the other one? Only 68%? He's in no cover. Like, why is it so low? Ah! <laughs> That's terrible. Ah, oh, man. All right. Let's run and gun Tomac. Up here instead. And try and have him kill this Muton. There we go. And let's give a chance to our other people here to kill this guy before we have Llama finish it off with a flamethrower. Can you see? Nice. Alright. 25% chance. Hey, it may hit. It may hit. It may not. That's a load of bulls. Yeah. Yeah, it is. Even if I were to move Poninator up here and take a shot with a pistol, it wouldn't finish him off. So we'll just dash we'll you up instead. And Ronak. Dash out. you up as well. And then uh, we'll just finish him off with the uh, with the flamethrower. Wow, and the other milk canisters that way. Okay. On my way. Well, let's collect this. Got the goods. And then we're going to move this way. Not sure if I want to dash up there. That may reveal aliens. But I know it's safe. Well, let's move right there for right now. So the melt is over there. Hmm. Guess that means you're gonna be moving you over here, Boninator. Move up, Chris. Move Warden back to where she was. Uh, I guess so. Aye, aye, Commander. And Ronak will dash you up move. here. Oh boy. Quiet. Did you hear something? Oh boy. Oh my god. Oh my oh no. That's that's uh that that's that's mm. <laughs> that's not good at all. I can move so it moved like right here, right? So I can double tap it with rapid fire with Tall Mac. Chris, I can move right there and try to shoot it. Or... We know that we can reach back there with the rocket. So I would definitely want to do that before I move Tall Mac. Alright, I'll tell you what, let's... Let's have Rana open this door. See what other options we have. I'm sure my team would love to get their hands on that thing. What? Oh, it. I didn't realize they could go into Overwatch when I just reveal them. That seems kind of whack. But okay, we do have Tall Mac. Exactly how far can you? Shoot that. So I could get Tall Mac 
up here first, and I should be able to... Okay, let's move up Tall Mac. He does have lightning reflexes, so we move him right here to be safe. Yep, lightning reflexes. Take that, Cyber Disc. Take this rapid fire in your face. Oh my god. And a second shot miss. Oh my goodness. That... That's no bueno. Oh boy. Oh boy. All right, nine damage. We only need to deal two more. So it's gonna be up to Llama. I wonder. Would this go through the wall? It looks like it would go through this. So could I just... The thing is, I don't know for sure. Don't know for sure that it does. The thing is, even right there, Llama's chance of hitting may be very bad. Kind of wish I had put a hole in that wall. Poninator? Can we see it from there? We are running out of options. God, I just I don't know if it's gonna go. It, it would make sense that it could go through the wall, right? In my Eighty percent chance to hit. And there's no way that I can coat it in fire without hitting someone else, right? Yeah. Oh, it's it's not even affected. Oh, okay. I guess that makes sense. Thank goodness. Okay, so we still have a little drone that's not really an issue. Overwatch, we'll move. I wonder if Warden can see it from there. No. Alright, well, we'll switch on Overwatch. Thank God we destroyed that cyber disc. Ponator, take it out! Five damage! <laughs> I don't even know if that's possible at this point in the game. Oh man, Warden, come on! Damn it! Damn it! Can't kill him if you don't hit him. That is a true statement. Watch the sides. And just ran away. And that sounded like a floater. Well, Ronick, let's see if we can't uh, finish it off. I've got a visual. That, yeah, that's fine. That's fine too. Sure, floaters. Fifty-nine percent chance to hit. Oh God. Oh, that sucks. I'm rolling. We could get a flank from right here, but then you're going to be exposed to the two other ones, but you do have a lot of hit points. Really? That's not flanking? What? In what world is that not a flank? Well, let's try. All right, at least you hit. I, I find that odd that that was not a flanking action. 
All right, Pwnernator, this, sh this could be an easy kill for you. I think it's possible to deal three damage with that plasma pistol. Nice! All right. Got you a kill. Talmac. I need you to reload. So... Hmm. I want to put you in full cover if possible, but also close enough to kill those bastards. But putting you in there is not a guarantee that you are not going to get seen. So I think I have to put you right there. And then you will reload. Warden, let's actually dash you up here. Well... Yeah, let's dash you up there. there now. Sarah, I guess we're just going to put you in Overwatch. And Llama, let's get you... Let's get you up here. And put you in Overwatch as well. Alright. Come on, Sarah. Yeah! That's what I'm talking about. Starting to lose ground. Oh, Jesus. Huh. That uh, somewhat complicates things. That's a hundred percent chance to hit. The others are sixty-five. Okay. Caliente can't see them. You have a 99% chance to hit that guy, but you can't see the others. And I want to stay in full cover, so I think that means we're going to have Pwnernator try to shoot down one of these. Can anyone else see that one that's just kind of floating up there? You two can't see them. Man, for all I know, there could be another group sitting right there. Aye, aye, aye. We may with. Uh, I don't want to. Ah, uh, damn it! <laughs> I want everyone to be able to take a shot, but I don't want to move over here because we may reveal more. So I think I may just end up dashing you back here. Damn. So we can... Can Warden move there? No, she can't. So we can for sure kill that one. If I activate your jet boot module... Cool, so I can get you up higher. Maybe that'll give you a better shot. 55, 75. I like 75. Let's try that one. Nice! Nice. Use that high ground. Ronak. The thing is, I can also move Ronak here and get a shot. Maybe I'll do that instead. Maybe he'll have a better shot than Honinator. What is this? Again, 65. But he can for sure kill that one. All right, let's move him back. What's your chance of hitting him? 50. Oh, that's actually worse. Damn it. Well, that was a bad trade-off, but let's give it a shot. Damn. Damn. All right, Pwnernator, uh, take this one out. We'll headshot just in case. And then Talmac. I think I'm going to run and gun you up there and blast him. I, I didn't want to move you up there, but um, we have no more options. If we reveal anybody else, I apologize. Just in case we do, I'll put you up there instead of right there, because this spot's easier to flank, whereas that one will be harder. Alright, buddy. There we go. 90% chance. Good shot. So there are still more aliens. 
All right, well, let's dash Warden in there. There's no way I'm going to put a rookie, <laughs> you know, advancer up by herself. God! How many of you are there? Well, this actually should be a pretty simple shot. Oh, what? Ponator can't see him? Hmm. Tall Mac can. You are out of ammo. Hmm. I would like to give Warden the kill. Try to level her up. Tell you what, let's move Ronak up here. Ronak. Uh, sorry if I'm mispronouncing that. We'll move Warden where he was because I want to keep her in full cover. What's your chance? 55, take it. Nice! Nice shots. Yes! God, yeah! <laughs> Everybody lived. We got all the meld again. Hell yeah. That's awesome. Whew. That was a lot of floaters. Outstanding. Nice. All right. So Warden, you got promoted to a heavy. But the meld they recovered will certainly advance our development of new technologies. So. Substance. Before we end, we also got a um, a Council Medal of Honor. What? Got some new autopsies. Remember, we will be watching. Let's look at this medal. Um, oh. Plus one aim and... W oh, okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Hmm. Let's give that to... Plus one aim and will... Well, I think Tomac is going to be in most of our missions, so he may... Ah, but he doesn't really need the aim. Because he, he... You know, the ideal situation is that he's up in the face and has a 100% chance to hit anyway. Uh, Llama? Llama definitely needs some additional aim. So there you go, Llama. Congratulations. You have another medal. And engineering. Arrived this morning, Commander. We're always glad to have more help down here. Warden, you did say you wanted to be a mech, so let's get you prepped for that. A chop here, a chop there, and soon enough we'll have a soldier <laughs> unlike anything the world has ever seen. Do you have to say it like that, Shin? Chop here, chop there. It's all good. We're only taking your arms and legs. Who needs them? All right, so we're going to have another mech soldier up here and running soon. Anything else to take care of before we end? I don't think so. We are out of money. Yeah. Yep, that's going to be it. So uh, thanks for watching, everybody. It was another great mission. Thankfully, we didn't lose anybody. Um, we're kind of starting to make this a trend of not losing anyone, and I like it. I want this to keep going. Uh, so hope you enjoyed the episode, and I will see you all next time. Take care.